And these are really high quality fans. And I'm glad they included this with the ROG liquid cooler. We have a little quick start guide here. Next, we have the motherboard mounting brackets. And the great thing about this liquid cooler is that it works both for Intel and AMD platforms. As you can see here, for AMD, supports the AM4 platform. And I'm gonna be using the Intel LGA 1200 bracket uh, to connect this to my motherboard. We have this radiator here. And look at that. So this is a 240 millimeter radiator, as you can see here. And it looks pretty solid, made out of metal. Very cool to the touch. All right, let's take out the heatsink part. So we take a look. Here's a heatsink at the bottom, and it does have thermal compound already pre-applied, which is great. You don't need to spend extra money on that. Okay, so taking a look at all the connectors you see here, you're gonna need a few connectors on your gaming PC. You're gonna need a SATA power connector. You are gonna need a connection for your all-in-one cooler, and you are gonna need a USB 2.0 connector. And the USB connector is used to control the liquid cooler. And then the last two connectors here are to connect the fans to the system. If we take a look at the top of the heatsink portion of the cooler, we do see that it has a cover here. And if we go ahead and remove this cover here, we do see underneath it, it has a very small OLED panel here. And this is where it's gonna read some vital information such as temperatures and so on. Depending on what you want to show here, you can even have customized text as well as a picture or logo of whatever you want, which is really great, really unique to this liquid cooler. In addition to that, you have a small cooling fan here. This is what's gonna blow cool air into your VRM units and everything surrounding the CPU because it's also important to keep your VRMs cool so that you get the highest overclocks. All right, so let's go ahead and peel off this sticker here. And there we go, nice and shiny. Okay, and if you see this white strip right here, that is the RGB lighting that is gonna come out of the liquid cooler. So if we go ahead and put this cover back, you'll see that the lighting will show up through here. Okay, let's go ahead and peel off all these stickers here. And look at how beautiful this looks. It is a little bit more on the expensive side, so it's more geared towards the gamer or the PC enthusiast. So if you want to have something really unique in your gaming PC that not many people are gonna have out there, such as a customizable OLED display that's gonna be viewable on your PC and looks really cool, then yeah, this is definitely for you. This is definitely unique. So I do wanna spend a little bit of time talking about some of the specs and features. So for the OLED display, it is 1.77 inch. So it's not the biggest OLED display, but it is color and you'll be able to customize it. As far as the radiator fans go, they are 120 millimeter fans that generate 122 CFM of airflow at 2000 RPM. And they operate at negative 29.7 dB, which makes them quieter than other fans out there. Now, as far as the pump embedded fan goes, it's something very unique. It does have a 60 millimeter fan in here. And finally, you have the RL Sync addressable RGB lighting strip right here, which is gonna give you some customizable lighting for your gaming PC build. All right, guys, so there it is. You got to see the Asus RG Ryogen 240 liquid cooler. As far as the RG Ryogen 240, it's just pretty awesome, guys. I mean, look at that. What other AIL coolers can have, like the logo anime like that? You can customize that. You can put text, you can put any, pretty much any logo you want. And yep, there's the radiator. So yeah, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video.